agree to let game industry journalist extraordinaire Dengekiko have exclusive interviewing rights. First off, don't start a conversation by saying which is why. So do you want us to do a quest or...? Because yuck, what a snore chore. I mean, we can do stuff other than go do generic quest R CPUs. Right, we don't do quests as slaves to our people. It's of our own volition for game industry's sake. I get that, but I wanted it to sound exciting and give quest a much more crucial connotation. Now, now, if we ignore most of Dengekiko's sensationalism, she does have a valid point. Although, I feel doing quests all for the sake of an exciting read is a rather vain reason. I knew Vert would say the words that my brain was thinking. Why not write about my adorableness instead? Or showcase my slender, toned legs reminiscent of a kangaroo? That'd be an instant hit with my fans. Sounds like a scoop. I'm on it. I'll pull as much cuteness out of each of you that I possibly can. Hang on. Things have been peaceful lately. And I don't think there were any quests demanding our attention. Yes, yes. I gathered you all here knowing full well that was the case. In truth, I've looked into several quest postings and isolated the ones that'll really make you four shine. <laughs> That's good. I was just thinking that there weren't enough articles being written about me these days. I bet everyone in game industry wants to read more about me. I'll agree to it too. Quests need to be reported on anyway. So this kills two birds with one stone. Hmm. So we're split about having these interviews. I was hoping you would agree unanimously. Can't be helped, I suppose. All right, Noir and Blanc, we'll have interviews in... Just a moment, please. I never said that I was not interested in having an interview. And I am also quite curious about the quests you have gathered for us to handle. Mert, you traitorous vixen! How could you turn your coat on me? But Neptune, I never agreed with you either. I would be foolish to let Noir and Blonde bask in the limelight. It has been ages since I left my bedroom, so it would feel like a waste to return empty-handed, as it were. Vert, you realize you just said something kind of pathetic, right? Don't hole up in your bedroom, okay? Instead, maybe we could, you know, like, hang out sometime. Or not. We could eat cakes with tiny forks, look at overpriced fashions, or even, um, visit your preferred arcade? Try not to make me into a charity case, will you? But I suppose I can consider your offer. Care to renege on your stance, Neptune? We're all going to move on without you. Yeah, just say you want to tag along with us. I'll go with the flow, sure, but aren't we supposed to have a conflict or argue or something? Like, we disagree at first and end up using the quests as a competition to drag each other's faces in the dirt. We ultimately bond in friendship, hold hands, and skip into the sunset, hoping for a brighter tomorrow. Doesn't that kind of setup sound like a way more tubular subject for your word-writing job? Stop making things so convoluted. If we have to drag you along, no way we'll finish before the sun sets. Whatever, party pooper heart. Let's get this conflict-free show on the road, then. Fun is fun, after all. Your motives aside, I'm happy to see that you all want to be involved. Oh, and your plot set up, Neptune? I'll keep it as a plan B in case my idea falls through for some reason. So what? Let's go, ladies. We gotta show Dengekiko and Game Industry what sort of stuff we're made of. Now loading. Right. Now loading. <laughs> Let's get going! Here we are! The first quest location! If I could get a word from each of you before we begin... Huh? Me first? Okay, then I'm gonna set the standard that others will try and fail to match. I am pleased to be a part of this interview. I will do my best now and in the quests to come. <laughs> Dude, 
Noir, way to sound extremely boring. Stiff as a bored board. Loosen up and act like a living thing. You're one to judge others. Fine, let's see you do better. If you insist, I'll show you how a sound bite is meant to sound. Biting. Howdy, game industry! How's the haps? It's -a me, your one and only idol of idol idling Neptune. Peace out. Um, you aren't being recorded. And please, don't do any of that peace out stuff unless I say to. Oops. <laughs> well, you can edit that out. Just keep the it's -a me part because that was comedy gold. Heavens, what sad examples you two have set. Although I expected no better from Neptune. Neither of you understands what it takes to make a breaking article. Allow me to show you the way. I shall show you all what it takes to ensure game industry's continued peace. Watch me shine as your wisest CPU. Not bad! Is it my turn? I better put my best foot forward here. Coming at you with her brightest smile is me, Blonnie Blonnie B. I'll do my Blonnie best, so please cheer me on! Um... Huh? But why? What just took over your personality system or whatever? Can you keep that up this whole game? It's been a while since we went on a quest, so maybe you got too giddy? Are you okay? Need a little nap? If you say that now, it makes what I said appear to be even more phony. But this is a war on character stereotyping. Noir is normal. Neptune is casual. Vert is formal. Those three approaches taken, my only choice left was to make an appeal as the cute one in order to stay relevant. You're all getting too complacent. I'll use this opportunity to break into a new market of believers. <sighs> I underestimated her again. But it's obvious my popularity will be impacted by this article, so... I see. The quests aren't the real challenge. The other CPUs are! Dengekiko, I demand a retake! Huh? Noir, please relax. That was just a lead-in, so it really isn't a big deal. Don't get critical quite yet. I think it was great to see your unique personalities come through. Come on, let's begin before it gets dark out. I'll be cheering you all on from the sidelines. Ugh, fine. I'm gonna win anyway, so that'll get things back on track. Yeah, don't fall down a pit and die. Let us keep the abrasive comments to a minimum, shall we? We're gonna show off our fancy pants moves in this quest, right, ladies? Right. Hey, everyone, I'm gonna nip nip you. Is 
ready. It's mine! Got it! Done! At long last, it's special move time! Take this! Take this! Seems different Change. from the rest. 32 big mega blades! Critical edge! Critical edge! Inside. Holy loss of fabric, you guys! Hang on a sec, everyone! W what happened to our clothes? Ah! What the hell is this? What's going on with our clothes? This didn't happen in any of the other games! Oh dear, what a conundrum. This will cause my popularity to grow even more. Hey, Idea Factory! I thought we had an agreement not to cross this line. What are we supposed to do about this? Why so antagonistic? We merely need to exit the dungeon and our clothes are magically repaired. I'm not surprised you aren't batting an Ivert, but how do you think poor Blonde feels? Don't drag me into your insecurities! This isn't a big deal! But in worse situations, right? I guess. It feels like our limits are constantly being tested, though. Aha! Uh -huh. This must be the unique sales point for this game. Bring it on! We'll still be strong female leads! Thank you very much, console patron units of game industry! Good grief, I am poopered out! It was a fun quest, though, so thanks. You have my thanks for this. I'll be happy to help any time you want to write another article about me. What an invigorating workout that was. Please call upon me again anytime. That was interesting. I look forward to reading your article. Okay, thanks, everyone! Leave the rest to me. I'll make sure it catches even our casual reader's eyes. I've got to head back to the office and type it up before midnight, so stay tuned! Being a game industry journalist must be a tough job. She finished working and has to go do more work? Yeesh! How about we all play some games while we wait for her article? <gasps> we just finished a quest and you already want to play games? You've got surprising stamina, Vert. Games are our lives. Count me in. I'll play until I drain your stamina bar dry. Be prepared for an all-night game-a-thon. I don't mind joining in. Enjoying games until the sun starts to come up is fun. Sometimes. Well, Noir, you were complaining about being tired, but what say you? We won't force you to join us, but... Of course I'm coming! Duh! Games are living or something, right? I can win against you all night! So 
is the broad who nods off while holding her controller. You should talk. You end up drooling right on my newest controller every single time. It's always you. True, Neptune always falls first. But watching her still push buttons in her sleep is equally enjoyable. Perhaps we should only play until we want to sleep? Whatever the case, we must make haste and begin playing.